All right, so just got done a guide trip, had a ton of fun, put the boys on about, I think eight, eight bass, and they went to catch some brim, just a dad and two young kids, but Jimmy's out here, my buddy Jimmy's out here fishing. I'm pretty sure I got you into swim baiting, right? Yep. Yeah, he's <laughs> he's addicted to it, and uh, anyways, we're gonna go throw Clash 9 and some other swim baits up the bank, see if we can't catch him here. I got about an hour before I got a meeting at the shop, so stick with us. Shaky head I got in there with a jig on it. Yeah. I ain't catching nothing. No, oh, really? All right, this got to have one on it right here. Not a good cast. Here he comes. Got him. Kind of. Oh, got him in a weird spot. He hit. Yep. God, that he got hooked in a really weird spot. Oh God. Oh my God. Got him. Good one. DRT Clash 9. Probably a three and a quarter. Thick fish though, boy, that's a healthy one. But Dreamcatcher's brown trout available soon. Stay tuned. But came back here, we noticed a little pattern of where these fish have been. Came back here, made a cast, slid it back here in the shade come up and ate it he actually hit it once like bumped it and then uh came back and headshot it awesome good fish thanks oh yeah i mean i f i feel like if we were in if i was in a tournament here's some more right there Got him. Two of them. Oh! Here's some more right there. Got him. Two of them. Oh! Here. You see, I had two of them on. I couldn't tell. God. That's a nice one. You getting the show out here now? Yeah, man. Golly. That one's hooked so good. He freaking went through the one jaw, up through his other jaw. That's another good one, about the same size, ain't it? Three and a quarter, maybe a little more. Freaking awesome, another one. I didn't see those up there until you... But, uh, no, look, 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 look. So that depth's 250. The hook is back here. It's a it's a 10 inch bait, you know, so it's an inch longer here. But the, the chest hook is back here. This this is far enough and it's slick enough it's not that silicone skin when they hit that silicone skin their teeth stop it's slick so their mouth tends to glide in and this hook sits actually about three quarters to an inch closer to the head than a depth 250 chest hook hmm. so when they hit the head here it usually gets them up under their chin likewise check this out it's four and a half inches the hooks are four and a half inches when they eat it it folds down those those hooks from that's exactly right. It goes from four and a half inches to about three inches. And you think, you know, that's a two pound bass can get both those hooks. So the hookup ratio is even better with this bait. All right, so a little update is we've been fishing for a total of about, what do you say, 45 minutes? About 45. Yeah, about 45 minutes. I have caught two and missed the one right next to the boat. And I'm just saying the the Clash 9 is that bait, man. It's versatile. It makes so much sense. Um, how I fish it and the applications I fish it, it's an it's an unbelievable bait. I'm throwing, uh, you know, our exclusive brown trout color right there, and uh, you can tell, man, it's it's been used. It's got some dang hook rash and teeth marks. But three fish so far in 45 minutes. Uh, gonna just fish this one last stretch and then I gotta go. So stick with us. Gonna try to finish with fireworks. Thank <laughs> you. 
Got him. You can just tail and they're going to eat it. Yeah. I'm like, dude, I'm seeing so many fish back here. It's nuts. Yeah, there's like six or eight bass. <sighs> Another one, probably two, two and change. He's blind in one eye. Once again, clash nine. Oh, there he is. Oh, look at him. There he is right there. Oh my gosh. That was. That was just lucky. Got him. Oh my gosh. That was, that was just lucky. Got him. That was that was pretty crazy. Yeah. He came out from under the pontoon boat. Another one, right at three, two and a half, two and three quarter. Yeah. DRT clash nine brown trout. Officially been out here for about an hour. Got four and missed one. Would have had a limit in an hour. Clash nine, putting them back. I did. I skipped that one right underneath that rope, yeah. and he he ate it. Good one. Whoa. Oh my gosh. I just feel like there should be some cruising wolf packs right here. Oh, there's one right there. Oh. It's a big smallmouth. Oh, dude. It's a big smallmouth. Dude, he just, he, he headshot it. Oh God, he's gonna eat it. Got him. Big and dude. Oh. My plan all day. That's the way they do. Oh. Alright, well, I'm loaded up with my boat, headed back home. That was fun. Got to fish with Jimmy for like an hour and 15 minutes, caught four, missed one. Uh right at the boat there, was just about to boat flip when he came off, had multiple bites, and uh man, that's just I think that's just a pretty normal uh time with a clash nine on that specific reservoir that we were on uh it's a special lake special bait you know that's the clash nine is the most versatile bait unbelievable for hunting wolf packs sight fishing hunting individual fish like we were doing uh had that giant giant smallmouth eat and not get hooked there at the end but man really fun thanks for watching the video if you liked it subscribe for awesome fishing content oh i think it's awesome you might not think it's awesome but if you do think it's awesome feel free to subscribe but i'm out See you guys next time.